While many of us welcome this warm up, it does come some with, uh, with some unwanted problems. CBS 2's Mai Martinez joins us live from the Gold Coast, where cleanup crews have been busy all day. Mai. Well, Erica, those warmer temperatures mean frozen pipes are thawing and breaking, and that means a lot of homeowners and business owners are dealing with a lot of flooding and cleanup now. Instead of baristas brewing, it was crews cleaning after a sprinkler line burst and flooded coffee shop in the Gold Coast. The building's owner, Brian Sword, got the call this morning. I come running from Moreland Park all the way here to see what was going on, and I had about four feet of water. The city's water department shut off the water and pumped out as much as they could. Sword's insurance company called in Brower Brothers Steamatic to handle the rest of the cleanup. Owner Rick Brower says it's been incredibly busy. We've been in business for 50 years. And I can't remember this long of a freeze. And that means little rest for the weary. So we've had guys work all through the night up until this morning and another crew to relieve them. And so you've got the coffee shop today. What other businesses and stuff are you responding we, to? We, uh, we're doing a lot of work at a major university. That university, UIC, which had flooding over the weekend due to frozen pipes. Burst pipes were also to blame for this frozen spectacle of ice on a fire escape over the weekend at a South Loop storage facility. The city closed streets in the area for safety reasons and used calcium chloride to clear the ice. Today, the ice was gone, but back in the Gold Coast, cleanup crews worry about what the warmer temperatures will bring. It's only going to get busier with all the, with the thawing right now, so we're going to get a lot more people that didn't have any idea they had a problem find out. The building's owner says the flooding caused tens of thousands of dollars in damages, but the good news is he believes the coffee shop will reopen tomorrow. And the cleaning crew that was working here just left to go to another call. Reporting live from the Gold Coast, Mai Martinez, CBS 2 News. Erica? Yeah, certainly a lot of work. Busy out there. Thank you, Mai.